What's going on, gangsters? Uh, Jason's here. And this clip, first clip right here. Uh, well, I have two clips, by the way. Uh, I've been debating on whether or not I wanted to show you guys this entire free-for-all game. But I finally have decided to just show you the ending. This last three minutes. At the beginning of this video, I was losing 950 to 600, I think it was. Uh, and obviously you can see uh, first week of the game being out I got my tiger camo on and my mp5 silenced for some reason I was super in love with the tiger camo the first week of this game if anybody doesn't know or any of you guys that are newly subscribed if you go back and watch my first few videos I was uh, rocking the tiger camo a lot but anyways uh, I'm gonna save the ending for you guys but I wanna like just talk about it a little bit before it gets here uh, if you guys have ever seen this before, or if it's ever happened to you, tell me the story in the comments section. But I'm not sure how many people are actually going to have it be uh, this close. I don't think that really gives it away. But, um, yeah, so just be sure to tell me. But I don't know how often you guys are ever going to see this or if it'll ever happen to you. But I thought this was really awesome, and that's why I wanted to share it with you. And um, I really got my ass kicked the entire free-for-all. Uh, so uh, that's kind of why I didn't want to show you the entire free-for-all. So I've kind of been thinking about it and debating it for a while now as to if I was going to show you the whole thing or just this little clip. Um, but yeah, so stay tuned for that little ending. And then I've actually got something after that that if you're getting bored of Black Ops, which I know some of you guys commented on my... When I was talking about quickscoping, I was kind of saying that... Um, in Modern Warfare 2, they had several like fun things you could do. Like some people enjoyed noob tubing, which I'm really happy that that's gone. Some people enjoyed quick scoping and stuff like that. So if you're kind of finding that thing that nothing's in Black Ops is like super fun, and now that this newness of the game is wearing off, um, I, I found something. Or actually, I didn't find it. My buddy Niaka showed me uh, showed me what you can do in combat training, and it is awesome, man! Like holy shit. Um, so, yeah, stay tuned for that as well. But uh, now we're under a minute left in this free-for-all. And see, now I'm feeling kind of comfortable. There's like 35 seconds left, and I'm up by uh, a kill. Now I'm up by two kills. So uh, now I'm kind of thinking that I've got this like on lockdown. But uh, it's n that's not necessarily the case <laughs> um, as I get killed there. But, uh, yeah, here's where it gets kind of interesting. There's about 15 seconds left. And I'm up by 100 points, two kills. So I'm like, okay, there's 10 seconds left now. I'm gonna win. Like, but then all of a sudden that RC car kill, RC car kill scares me a little bit. Uh, and now we're tied. I'm like, holy shit, there's two seconds left. And I see this guy. Now look at this. I freezed it here. There's 0.1 seconds on the clock. But look over there in the kill feed. My my kill's not in there yet. Uh, so th that's kind of how close this game was. Uh, I don't know if that's ever happened to y'all. I actually wasn't even aware that there was like a time differential from the kill feed and the the plus 50 showing up. But I thought that was really awesome and like kind of amazing actually. Like I've never seen that on a YouTube video before. But that was a super close free for all right there. And uh, now I'm going to show you guys what you can do in combat training to to maybe give you guys some fun. And you and your friends can go in here and do this. I think it works best when you have two people. But you can do as many as you want. But basically, uh, this video doesn't exactly show you because I'm running around quick scoping in a free for all. Now, this is also something you can do that's really fun. Uh, you just put the difficulty on recruit, so it's like super easy. And obviously, I know this doesn't actually simulate a real free for all, and that I'm not sweet because I can beat these guys. But if you just want to practice your quick scoping and practice your gameplay, um, that's a good way to do it. Just run in here and put it on recruit at first. And then as you feel more confident, raise the difficulty when you're quickscoping and stuff like that. Uh, because basically you just totally mess up your kill death if you actually try to run around in a real free-for-all trying to quickscope. So then once you feel super comfortable, you can run around and actually try to do it in a real game. But uh, that's not what I wanted to actually tell you guys about. Uh, you can use any gun in the, what I'm about to tell you. You go into combat training and you set it on team deathmatch. And you can set the human players to two and the enemies to nine and what you do is you set it on recruit just like you would do in this quick scoping thing and you set your kill streaks like super high like chopper gunner and dogs or chopper gunner and gunship and then whatever other kill streak you want um it seems like the rolling thunder works really well 
But when you do roll like rolling thunder, it always kills you, even even if you're inside the buildings. So maybe napalm strike. But you just totally dominate them. Uh, oh, and you set the the total, the final score to be up to thirty thousand. So it takes three hundred kills to win the game, and you and a buddy can just go in there and tear ass, man. And it's so fun. Like you might think it would get boring, just totally crushing them. But man, we play. I did that shit for like two and a half hours straight now. And uh, after I eat, I plan on going back and doing it again. Like it was just so fun to just totally crush. And when you get in a chopper gunner and you got nine enemies out there on Nuketown, and you just uh, totally rape ass because it's on recruit. None of them shoot the air support down. And uh, it's just super fun, man. Uh, you guys might not agree. You might think it's kind of boring to just totally crush somebody. But uh, I've just been getting kind of bored with Black Ops. I think I have over three or four days of gameplay now. And um, I just got kind of a little bit bored right now. But uh, this is definitely making me have a lot of fun running around doing this quick scoping. But definitely the one where you set your kill streaks real high and run around and uh, kill all the guys with any weapon that you want. And you'll actually get a lot of amazing kills where the guys just line up and you get like triples and quads with your different weapons. So it's really fun when you got a buddy there with you. So uh, I hope you guys will try that out and tell me what you think. And uh, y'all have a good night. Later, guys.